Changes are coming to Greek houses at Indiana University. In just over a week, three fraternities were issued cease and desist letters. Fox 59's Max Lewis explains what Greek leaders are doing now and how students feel about the new policies and regulations. Being put on cease and desist is just one level lower than being suspended from campus altogether. Greek life leaders now making some changes, trying to make sure they don't get to that point. School here has only been in session for three weeks, and Greek life leaders admit some parties have gotten out of hand. It's part of the reacclimating back to campus, and we're looking forward to things settling down a little bit. The three fraternities that were issued the cease and desist, Sigma Alpha Mu, Sigma Phi Epsilon, and Alpha Epsilon Pi, received them for alcohol violations and for endangering others. Even with that, Greek leaders felt they should step in and make some changes. We had some pretty general, vague clauses in our bylaws, previously, but we wanted to be very clear what everyone was going to be accountable to. Starting this weekend, new rules will be in effect, requiring things like a sober monitor for every 20 people, ID checks at the door, and there's a ban on hard liquor from being served. Leaders say the conversation started after all Greek events were suspended last year following an uptick in sexual assaults. We knew that something had to change. It just took us a little bit to figure out what that looked like and how to get everyone to buy into that process. Some students think it It'll make a difference, others not so much. It's good that they're trying to crack down that and keep everyone yeah. under control. I don't think that's actually going to make people safer per se, but like at least they're trying, I guess. I use Interfraternity Council President Ethan Goldie feels the changes will make fraternity and sorority events some of the safest on campus. There's no house party that has private security IDing you at the door, checking if you're on the guest list, wristbanding you if you're under 21. Like all of those measures are not taken at every tailgate and house party. The fraternities in question are on cease and desist until further notice. They'll then go through a disciplinary process that will determine their future here at the university. On the IU Bloomington campus, I'm Max Lewis, Fox 59 News.